today we are going to see how can we move the files from windows a local system to first to hadoop environment like in hadoop sandbox as we are going to use http sandbox provided by hortonworks so i'm going to move my file from windows to first to hadoop sandbox and from there we will load that same data into HDFS. So let's get started. So here as you can see I have logged in into my HTTP sandbox and this is my Ambari view. So I'm going to switch to files view and I'm going to show you first like my HTFS folder where we can load the data. So I have created a data folder here and inside the data folder I have input data so this is my hdfs location and the goal is to put the file here so there are two ways where we can load the data directly to hdfs so if you are using the ambari view you have directly option of upload so use upload go to this upload folder and pick any file from here so just I selected geo location uh, truck.csv and open it here and you will see that file came here so this is the easiest way to load the file into HDFS so yeah so this is the WinACP environment so I created a HDFP, HDFP sandbox so this will be your host name and the port number is time two and I'm logging through the route so when you log in here so when you log in it will go to your root folder so here I created a HTTP folder you can create your own anything and I'm just what I'm trying to do here is I'm just moving any file from my local system to the sandbox environment so this file as of now sits in my sandbox environment not in the uh, our HDFS environment so to load this file into your HDFS environment I will show you here also like yeah see here so let me refresh it okay so currently we have only truck.csv right we don't have geolocation so now the uh, we have to load that geolocation file into this HDFS environment so to do so I'm going to log in into Putty. So here I just click here so it will directly open the Putty and if you you can open separately also just enter your password to log in. I'm using the root. So if you do ls minus ltr here you will see the folder. I'm going inside my HTTP and if you list it out so you will see this file is there. So to load this file into Hadoop environment you have to use Hadoop DFS minus put use this file and if it is not in the, this location you can just provide the full path and then your HDFS path so once you hit enter it will take some time and yeah it's showing done so go here check it out yeah so the geolocation file is there so guys we have seen like there was two ways to load the file so I suggest to use always the command one because that's the one which you will use in the real time and that's it for today guys thanks thanks for listening have a good day